endoderm. There are also forms of life that remain fixed to the seabed and make up the endofauna group. Even more interesting is observing the interaction between the different species, like the fantastic cleaning stations where small cleaning wrasse or shrimps move all over the fish and remove parasites or flakes of dead skin. In some cases, it is enough to have just a dive slate to carry out a study of the marine life, but some other items of equipment may also be useful. For the PSS Advanced Open Water Diver course, your instructor will have you make a guided dive and you will be provided with waterproof identification cards. In this way, you will learn to recognize the various forms of life and identify them. A compass and a dive light will also be useful, while the dive computer will provide you with the information about the depth and water temperature. It is recommended that any actions you take while observing the marine life are coordinated and supervised by someone scientifically qualified, ideally a marine biologist. Using a camera is a good way of recording your observation, but it is not enough. Remember to also note down the depth, the temperature of the water and any eventual interaction with other species on your dive slate. We are certain that after this dive, you will see the underwater world from a different point of view. Happy diving!